Hey guys, this is Jolie Poffel, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Luigi's Mansion. Just to do a really quick recap of what happened last time, I powered through the first area of four in Luigi's Mansion. I got the father ghost, the mother ghost, and Chauncey, the baby ghost, which was your first boss battle. So anyways, I'm going to be going, once again, back into this, and we will be starting Area 2, and I hope that we can enjoy ourselves once again. So, he's gonna ask us where we want to go. I won't bring you guys to the gallery until closer to the end of the game, just so you can see the gallery when it's full versus empty. I realized I never showed you guys this cutscene before, so I'm gonna show it to you now. He's kind of waving you off, and it's like you're gonna die and stuff like this so this time you're entering just as terrified as before up uh, that flashlight Ugh. anyways so yeah um the that's I'm only gonna show you that that one time <clears throat> and I also forgot to show you this last time I won't really do much here but if you take a picture of if I can control this if you could take a picture of a mirror, it teleports you back to the room I'm standing in right now, it teleports you back to the lobby. So, if you ever need to cut back here really quick, you just need to do that. So anyways, time to go to area 2 and get this ivy stuff off this door. What always bothered me about this noise is that the boring noises that come up never matched up with the flares of light. So, that always bothered me, but you know what? I'm not gonna let it get to me too much. <gasps> There's the golden mouse! Get it! Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, yeah! Alright. So that was one of the golden mouses of the game. Golden mouses, as I said before, only appear in the dark. Hush in there! I'll be there in a minute. Shh! Whatever. Thank you. See, all you have to do is be stern and punch at walls. Anyways, <clears throat> excuse me as I'm still a little sick. I don't remember where I'm going, so I will be looking at my map. Okay, that's where I thought I was going, but I wasn't sure. So I'm going in here. Now these guys are really annoying because they latch onto your back. Oh. So, these guys are basically rapists, and you have to watch out for them as you would real rapists. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Looks like you've run into a bit of trouble there. Maybe you need more training. I didn't- what? I didn't run into any trouble. I didn't lose a single- You guys are stupid. There are always some ghosts who will try to grab and hold on to you. Right, rapists. When that happens, try moving your control stick back and forth and shake them off. That's what I did. Just so you guys know, that's what I was doing when you heard the clicking. If you heard the clicking. I don't know. It's the age-old struggle for survival, my boy. Don't lose heart, Luigi. My boy. Sorry, just thought about it from uh, Legend of Zelda. <clears throat> the king always goes, my boy, when he's talking to Link and whatnot. So anyways, let's get this key now that there are no more rapists in the room. Let's see where we have to go next. Ah, one of my least favorite rooms. Awesome. Anyways, so I want to talk to you guys real quick about um, how I'm recording this time, which is slightly different. I don't know if you can tell with the audio, because my audio was surprisingly clear to me before. But this time, I have Turtle Beaches. I, my brother and I went out and we bought Turtle Beaches. And... Wow, I'm sorry. You had to see that. Anyway, we bought Turtle Beaches, so now we can record with better sound. And hoping that this is going to be much better. Tell me if you hear any difference, and if not, that's not like I'm not going to use them anymore. But just want to know if it makes anything better. So anyways, we are in the dancing room. As you can see, these guys are having a whole bunch of fun, and I kind of feel bad that I'm taking everything from them. Like him, I'm taking his dance partner. Anyways, these are shy guys. You have to... T 
take off their masks before you suck them up, which is a little bit annoying, because, well, you can't just do this. Anyways. So, ow! Ugh. Well, I'm sorry. Apparently, he's the only one who's ever fought back to me before, telling me that I can't have his dance partner. But I bet his dance partner really feels loved right now. Oh. Nice music. Make it a rave in here. Okay. So this is the dancing couple. I don't quite remember their name. Oh, I'm... Jesus Christ, I'm so bad at this game. Why am I doing this? Anyways. So this is the dancing couple. You have to stand on these rotating things and wait for them, wait for the guy to bow, and then he'll go and be all like, oh, you can take me now. I can steal his heart before she does. <laughs> all right, anyways, the music stopped. Um, so this is awkward. I just kind of wanted to you know, maybe hear more creepy music, but I kind of ended it, apparently. Can I see you? Stop it. Oh my god, this is terrible. This is why I don't have any nice things. Ugh, oh, thunder. That was my thunder noise, in case anyone was wondering. Alright, so I'm gonna keep running around this thing until he decides to show his heart, because he's one of those guys who doesn't show his heart, he's one of those non-feeling men. So anyways, I want to talk to you guys a little bit about me, because I didn't really do that last time, at least not to a, as much as I wanted to. So anyways, I am, in, as you know I said last time, I am a junior in high school, and as a junior in high school, I am starting to apply for colleges and look for colleges and stuff. Not the most fun thing in the world, especially when all the things you're getting from colleges are pieces of crap. It, it's almost like you can sort out everything that you would be, like, not needing. Or not, like, I'm not gonna go to this school if they send me a letter. You can almost do that. Not quite, but you can almost do it. Especially the ones who are like, we don't even need to see your SAT scores or ACT scores. Nah, no, I'm not gonna go there. But that's just because I'm a cocky bastard. Anyways. So, we're going in here and- oh, 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 oh. There's a red rapist. Anyways, more about me. I am a musician, and that's basically everything I do all the time. Uh oh, god. Rapist. I hate rapists. I hope you do too, otherwise I'm concerned and want to run away. Speaster, no! Speaster! Speaster! No! Oh, oh. Yes! No! Stupid purple thing, I'm gonna kill you so much. Ah. Alright, anyways. So, the uh, instruments that I play, I can play the alto and tenor saxophone and the soprano saxophone. The flute... There's a button over here. Hmm. All right. And a little bit of the trumpet and the piano. I'm, once you hand me something with strings, like a guitar or a bass or whatever, or harp, if you go that way, I am absolutely terrible and you don't want to see me ever again. So I stay away from those. And music is my life. I'm one of those typical band nerd kids. So, if you want to hit on me, go ahead. I'll cry. In this corner. Right over here. I'll hit the wall in frustration. Alright. So, we're going to press this button and watch this cutscene. Who's there? Who dares to disturb our sleep? Oh, it's Luigi! Look, guys! Luigi's finally here! We're gonna do what you did to your brother, only worse. Hey, Gads Poltergust 3000! Everybody scram! I don't know why I gave them, like, a oh. New York accent. 
New York. I'm sorry. I hope none of you people are from New York and are going to hate me for this. I just want to listen to this music for a second. I hope you do too, because you're going to have to. Anyways, we're going to pick up now. Luigi, are you okay? That was them! Those were the ones who released all of the ghosts from the paintings in my gallery! Those are friends! I wondered where King Boo and his gang had gone, so they were hiding in the mansion all along! Thanks for flushing them out, Luigi. I'm, ticked you I I'm tickled you found them, but perhaps it would have been better if you hadn't... Well, let every single one escape. Just a thought. Alright, I didn't know that this button in this mansion was going to let out every boo in the entire world. So, I mean, they were caged inside of the ground and they can face through walls, so I don't know why they couldn't just phase out of the cage. Let's not question the logic, let's keep going. Oh, well, water under the bridge. Anyway, you should probably come back to the lab for a sec. Okay. I've been waiting for you, young Luigi. I'm probably like 30. Maybe maybe older. Just saying. So I'm not quite young. Maybe young compared to you because you look a little bit like a rusty dinosaur. Your brother must have been taken by that gang of booze, poor feller. Yeah, you're definitely a dinosaur. No one says feller. Oh, now don't talk crazy. They're not gonna eat the man. But what became of him, hmm? Odd that he hasn't come back. Common theory holds that booze grow in strength when they travel in numbers. They must somehow combine their powers, too. Their power likely overwhelmed your brother. Finally, something Mario couldn't handle, and Luigi can. Maha. <laughs> if you aim to save Mario, there's but one way to do it. Capture each boo and slowly weaken the group's power. Oh. And you're not gonna help at all. You're just gonna tell me, Good job, bro. No, you wouldn't use bro. Good job, feller. Anyways. <clears throat> But booze, as the name implies, like to hide and then jump out. To scare people. You've got your work cut out finding them. <laughs> Don't get all down in the mouth. Whoa. Egad, I didn't know you were that way. That Game Boy Horror I give you as a secret function. Alright, I don't want to waste too much time in this cutscene. So it's basically this thing called a Boo Radar, and you'll see it just in a second. <clears throat> I'm going to the mansion, bro. Why would I go to your gallery or the training room? I understand the training room a little bit. Alright, so we're gonna go on a hunt for booze. Booze are different than a lot of other ghosts. Um, booze can be in the light. Now you see in the bottom right hand corner. Now, just saying, whenever you see this bulge in the table, oh, yeah. Boo's there. I'm not gonna lie. Boo or his fake boo is there. Fake boo! You have to watch out for that. There's typically two things in every room. The real boo and the fake boo. So, in order for your blinker thing to go away, you have to have both open. I am Bamboo, if you please. I am going to sick a panda on you. Alright, I've caught my first boo, that's all he's talking about. I probably am not gonna read everything he says, because I am a jerk. No, didn't mean to save. God damn it. I hate this game! Flip that table and rage. Alright, next room. See, now it's back to flashing yellow as it was blue before. I'll show you the blue again in case. If I remember. Let's shake that. Yay! Bootha? I don't know what your actual name is supposed to be there, like Gunther or Bertha? Probably Bertha. So that was a girl. No, I'm not saving. Get out of here. And mon money randomly fell out of the ceiling. Alright, now you see in the bottom right corner that there's a blue light on top of the Game Boy Horror. That blue light means that there's no more boos or anything boo-related in this room. 
I, I never explained the mechanics of it, but I'm sure you've been figuring it out. As I get closer, because it's right here. Watch, I'll, I'll do it slowly. It starts to flash red and get faster and whatever. Want to play Game Boo? Ah, oh, Boo puns. Ow. Now this can happen. This is when Boo's travel to another room. So he's in this room now. But anyway, you're going to hear about 50 Boo puns. You've heard three so far. Um. So if you don't like Boo puns, stop watching this Let's Play right now because they will never stop and they only get much worse. I don't know why I went out here. That toad needs to get a life, because all he's doing is standing on the balcony waiting for me to open that door, and I can prove that to you later, in just a moment. So anyways, um, I want to talk a little bit about Luigi's Mansion 2. Luigi's Mansion 2 is supposed to come out in America in about a month. It's going to be March 24th, and I don't know about you guys, I'm really excited for it. I'm going to be definitely getting it it's for the 3DS, and it's for fun and epic and greatness. This game was always one of my favorites, so seeing the option to have... Taboo? Taboo? I can't let Taboo be in here. Alright, anyways. So, Luigi's Mansion 2 is going to be called Dark Moon. And it's going to be for the 3DS, which means that it will have 3D capabilities. And, oh, that's that's the twins' room. You'll see them later. Hmm. So, we're back in Chauncey's room. I'm going to open everything. See, that's a big heart. That heals you more than 10. That heals you, like, 30 or 40, I don't remember. But anyways, back to Dark Moon. It looks really great. He's supposed to be really fast. Look how slow he is. Right, because he was turbo. Turbo. Anyways. Yeah, he said feller again. You guys better watch out. Um, I don't really know a whole lot about it, so if you guys do and you want to post something in the comments to make me feel like an idiot, then go for it and I will accept it, because I will take any information I can get. So anyways, I'm proving that Toad is just waiting for Luigi to open that door. He's standing outside this window, right on that balcony, and he can see me, by the way, if you could see his head turning back and forth as I walk by. He's waiting for me. So, I'm gonna make him wait, because he's creepy and kind of bothering me. So let's see what bad boop on this time. I am the yummy boolish... No. No, that doesn't even work. Delicious, boolicious. Unless you were boodalicious. Ha! That's what he should have named himself. Boodalicious. Except, boo delicious, you know? Alright, I'm not gonna help the game make boo puns, because there's still, like, 44 more, and I don't want to make you guys suffer. I mean, I do a little bit, but I don't really want it that bad. Alright. So, I'm just going and visiting all the rooms that I've already gone in. And getting all the booze. That reminds me... Oh. When I said I was going to be getting all of the booze... Well, I'll getting 100% on this game, I meant all of the booze, and then... Everything else is just gonna fall into place. I ever get what I'm doing. What am I doing right now? Whatever. I'll figure it out. Oh. Well, here's a ghost that we can't see yet. This is one of the painting portrait ghosts. He's the butler who carries around a candle walking in the hallways because he has nothing better to do with his life. He's a loser and everyone hates him. Like me. I hate him. He's... Alright, I'm not gonna be mean. Yes, I am. That's who I am. Terrible person. Alright. Looking for the boo in this room. So that painting. Hello, I am Bulala. Oh, he has 60 health instead of 50. What you'll notice later as we keep catching more and more booze 
the boos will get more and more health. Um, some even get all the way up to 300, and it's a pain in the butt because you have to travel between rooms like eight times to finally catch them because they're stupid and I hate them. It makes me want to cry and die a little bit inside. Just call me Game Boo. He must be f before the Game Boo Advance guy. I gotta say, there's no room over there. You can't go that way. I thought he went through the wall, and I was gonna freak out because there's. N I'm pretty sure I can't go that way. It might just be the hallway though, so I could be crazy. So I need to remember where to go now, and I'm not sure I can do that. And I have about nine minutes left to record, and I have no idea what I'm doing. I got this, guys. Don't worry. I got this. Oh, yeah. By the way, this will be lesson three for all of you people out there. Whenever you can press the B button to press your flashlight, do it. You know why? It's just fun. Ready? You can. It doesn't stop you at all. You could just... Nick. Oh, I was gonna go with the music, but then he <clears throat> stopped singing. All right, I'm not gonna voice act Toad. I'll just read it because you know what happened last time. I was like, yeah, 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 and I don't want to make you guys die again. So a really important thing to me in the toilet. Oh yeah, he flushed it. How did you accidentally flush a key that massive in the toilet? I didn't mean to. Goodbye. What in the? Yeah. I'm not going to be nice to you. I have no idea how you managed to drop a freaking key that massive in this toilet and then close the lid and flush it. What are you doing? Are you stupid? All right. I'm going to say don't worry about it so the lights turn on. He's like, don't cry over spilled milk. It's an old worry anyways. Yep, I'll just let it swirl on down into the depths and let happiness refill my life. I feel like the pipes being as small as they are here would have a major issue getting that key down them. Which is why it wasn't an issue. I think I have to go in here now. Where am I going? What am I doing? Oh yeah. I really sincerely hope that nobody in the audience is slightly epileptic because I am always flashing the light. This is an interesting room because I can't physically see the ghosts so I have to use the mirror to be able to see them. Which is really interesting concept because I mean I can't see him until you flash your light. So if you really wanted to you could just spin uh spin in circles like like this until oh oh rape is really close he's really close he's so close okay sorry i thought i was about to be raped flicker 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 oh anyways so using the mirror is a really interesting concept similar things happen later in the game and you'll see those you have to watch out when a lot of rapists come like, there's one right behind me. I can see him. Like a pro. Like a pro. Didn't get raped. The, they seem to come in a bunch of different colors. Apparently, white are ones that can only be seen... Or, that can be seen in all cases. They have 10 health. Red can be seen in all cases and have 20 health. And then there's... Um, blue, which can be seen in mirrors only. And time to do something, because I just picked up a very special item. Hey now, Luigi! Wow, voice change. He had to run into that. <clears throat> Sorry. What have you found there? Let's take a look at that! Come on. Oh my god, he's so short. He was jumping. Did you see that? Ooh, ah, uh, 
it! It's a fire element metal! Now you can use the fire element! Yes sir! With that you can catch fire element ghosts! Hmm? What's a fire element ghost, you ask? Why, they show up wherever you see fire, my boy! They're ghosts of fire itself, if you will! If you approach a flame, they'll be surprised by your presence and leap out into the air, and then you can vacuum them right up... away. Oh, what? F fuck, I'm sorry. After that, you can expel fire with the L button. You can melt ice, light candles, and do all kinds of stuff. A meter will appear down at the bottom of the screen, so keep an eye on how much element you have left. Okay, fell- No, no more feller. I'm serious. You're done. You're done. I'm not even- I'm not even. So I have to find the boo. We'll do that. That's the fire element ghost. And now I have fire! I'm trying to get the boo out. Oh, he only has Kung Boo. Kung, is that supposed to be Kung Fu? Kung Fu or whatever. Okay. Yeah, I'm going with Kung Fu. So, anyways, to get out of this room, since the door is still chained, I have to use the L button to light this. All these candles. So I'm going to do that and walk out of here. I'm not going to worry about this yet. You'll see it later. I'm pretty sure I might actually have to light this. Light all the candles. Light the building on fire. That da 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 da. What's this key? Yay, keys! I love keys, except they're massive. If I had a key that big for my door. You know what? I'd actually be okay with it. I lied. I'd be okay with it. So, now that we have the fire element, guess who we're paying a visit to? I don't know if you guessed it because I can't hear you. So I'm gonna assume that you said this guy. This guy's a scared of her. Alright. Ow. He, okay, he's making a really annoying noise, so I'm just gonna do a strobe light behind him so that we can feel better about it. He thinks he's going that way, and then he's gonna come back. Ow. Strobe light, strobe light, strobe light, strobe light, strobe light. Come on, bro. Face the truth. So he's gonna go down in this room. And then he's gonna go in here. So let's battle him. This is the butler. Let's take him out. What's annoying about battling him is that if you touch a mouse, you're gonna fall. I'm really close to touching this mouse. I'm really close to touching this mouse. I'm really close, really close. All right, I didn't touch the mouse. Congratulate me, be happy. All right. I have about one minute or so left, but you know what? If this key is where I think it's going, I'll go to battle him first, because I think he's probably one of the most hilarious bosses. Oh, it's not there, but it's in a better place. So let me get this boo, and then I will talk to you about that room. Oh, a ball. You found me, peekaboo. All right, that one wasn't so bad. That was okay, because peekaboo is actually what we say. Oh, are you kidding? He has three health left. This is stupid. Stupid! Are you serious? Are you freaking kidding me? Alright. I'll have to go get him in a second. I'm just gonna clear this really small room. Did you hear that? Oh! You found Mario's hat! It's been laundered. Red Rapist, not a problem. There's one more ghost in here somewhere, strobe light around. Oh, there's two. What do you know? 
Oh, he's really weak. All right. Do 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 do. I think this is just money, but. You know what? I'm not gonna show you the room this time. I'll show it to you next time because I want to spend a lot of time in there, and I don't have a lot of time left. So I'm gonna get this boo, and I will show you the rest next time. So let's see. Yeah, I'll get down and boogie. We're going to boogie, guys. I hope you guys like to boogie. I like to boogie. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. All right. So let's see, where'd that last stupid frickin' boo go? I can't believe I lost him, I have no idea where he is. Let me see. Oh, he's over there. I can't get to him. Alright, well, thank you guys for watching. I've been Jonely Poffle in my Let's Play of Luigi's Mansion. And I hope you guys have all been enjoying it and will join me once again next time.